Hey twirlers, thanks for tuning in. Today, I'm going to teach you how to do an elbow roll. If you do not know how to do a hand roll or a palm spin yet, I suggest you click the links to learn how before you watch the rest of this video. All right, let's get to it and learn how to do an elbow roll. Begin with the baton in our normal starting position and then move it down beside your hip in a cradle. Make sure you are also using proper body technique with your feet in a right tee and free hand on your hip. Next, take your free hand and point it straight out like you're going to do a hand roll, but instead place your left hand on your right shoulder. Make sure you don't get lazy elbow disease by dropping your arm down. Make sure your elbow is pointing straight out with your arms slightly higher than shoulder level to give the baton a good platform to roll across. Take the baton and place it underneath your elbow arm. Your baton hand will be on the left side of your bent arm. Check to make sure the baton makes contact with your arm. This will ensure that it will roll over your arm instead of being tossed like some beginner twirlers like to do. After the baton has been placed, push it over your arm. The baton will have contact with your arm the entire time until it is ready to be caught. You will catch the baton in your right hand, palm up. It should look like the baton is falling into your hand. No slapping or grabbing to catch the baton is necessary. Just a side note, even though this is called an elbow roll, it technically does not roll on your elbow. It rolls on your arm between your elbow and shoulder. Now practice along while I do the elbow roll in slow motion. Make sure you place the baton on the other side of your arm and check to make sure the baton is making contact with your arm the whole time during the roll until you catch it in your right hand, palm up. Destinies run together, Raziel. Now let's try the elbow roll in our left hand. Stand in our normal starting position and then move the baton into the cradle. Point the right arm straight out and then place your right hand on your left shoulder. Make sure your right elbow is pointing straight out and not down to the ground. Next, take the baton and place it underneath your elbow arm. Make sure you place your baton hand on the right side of the bent arm. Check to make sure the baton makes contact with your arm and then push it over your arm, catching it palm up in your left hand. Let's try the elbow roll a few more times. Great job, twirlers. You now know how to do an elbow roll in both directions. Make sure you like this video and subscribe to help support my channel so you can keep learning how to twirl baton with me. Also, hop on over to my website at howtotwirlbaton.com so you can stay up to date with me and all my twirling shenanigans. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the flip side. Next time on The Abbey Twirls. It's time to amp up the horizontal twirling difficulty with a double flat. Stay tuned on Twirling Tutorial Tuesday, September 3rd at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. Twirl on!